today we are going to see how to utilize the corner treatments so let's see how we can do it so this is our part so where we will be using the corner uh, parameters let's go with the top view let's go for cam wire radium I am selecting Ajay Charman's cut P550 with the geometry node creation let's go with surface selection now I will select uh, surface this one slightly I will move it up I want this one this and this and let's go with this too so I have selected these profiles and I will be selecting this one also after selecting just confirm so I have selected some profiles and I have applied a XY surface selection then I will be creating for all entry motion by geometry center just I am selecting window selection and confirm it so it will create the entry motion so now in the top view you can see for all this geometry entry motion has been created so next we will go for a wizard process before that I will explode this geometry so in that case so we can utilize the single geometry to utilize for corner treatments so now I'll be selecting a geometry tool so this is my geometry tool and here I'll be applying some corner parameters so let's go for wizard so inside wizard in the wizard we'll be using process wizard where we need to select the parameters and the technology here I am selecting a number of passes is 3 with the brass 900 wire and the diameter is 0.25 after selection you can see here all the parameters has been updated so go for next and next here is the corner treatments so we have a corner types so now I am applying for in the process wizard we have seen that I have given the 3 passes so 3 passes has been enabled here so for one cut that is roughing I'll be using this fire in this fire option I'll be using any one option so this is screw circle cone chamfer and stripe so let's go with the crew for this geometry so I'm selecting a crew option and the length I'll be giving a 1 mm and the width is equal to 1 mm so after that we'll go for next I'm not creating any remnant cut here so next and accept and calculate so once you calculate the process you can see the corners has been created with a crew so this is for only one cut if I click on the process one you can see here only for this one cut crew has created and for the skimming there is no crew so why because we have enabled only one cut from the visa so like this we can utilize the corner parameters let's go with other uh, corner parameters also let's go with another geometry and uh, this is the geometry and I'm going for a wizard process so same process I'm creating a process wizard with the three number of passes and a brass wire with the diameter of 0 0.25 just I'm clicking on the corner parameters and here I'm enabling a one cut now we'll go for the circular so in this I'll just go with 0 0.5 5 mm of a radius which is one diameter and the deviation is you can give the deviation or you can go with uh, zero uh, here I'll be giving us one mm of deviation and here also same thing I'm not creating any uh, remnant and calculating the process so here you can see here this corner radius has been created 
have given the 1 mm of deviation so from here it has taken the deviation of 1 mm and the radius of 0.5 so this is how same way you can see here for skimming also uh, I have not given it so it has not taken it so this is only for roughing which has given it so like this you can give for corners let's go for another process so here I am selecting for this geometry let's go for wizard here same process uh, calling the process wizard I'm going for a three cuts with the brass 900 0.25 wire and straight away we are going for a corner parameters and enabling the cut which is required and here I'm going for a conical V shape or we can say V shape so here I'm going to give 1 mm of length and here or you can select 2 mm of uh, length and 1 mm of width and uh, you can go for next without ramen cut uh, to visible I'm giving uh, a large amount of uh, numbers so after calculating you can see here you can see here the conical shape has taken in the roughing cut and uh, these two green line is for skimming only for roughing it has taken the conical V shape so this is how we can utilize this process too same way if I checked in skimming so you can see the cut is inside and also this cut is inside only for roughing it has been taken so next is a chamfer type so let's go with this is the good way to see for a chamfer so let's go for a wizard so same process we are calling a process wizard with the number of cards and the wire and the diameter of the wire and going for the corner parameters set the wizard so here I will activate this three cuts also so here you can see I'm going for a chamfer type so we need some materials uh, in the corner so in for that portion we are going for this so here uh, the side is equal to length here I'm giving 1 mm of length and the width is around 2 mm So you can utilize both or you can go with 2mm of this with the zero whichever is convenient to you we can go for it so here I'm giving 2mm of length where I need a chamfer value so next 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 and accept and calculate so now uh, the calculation is taking place so you can see here we have got all the cuts as a chamfer so first cut is a chamfer second cut is the chamfer and the third cut also is a chamfer so by this uh, you can get some stock material at the corner so next we'll go for a let's go for a top view zoom all next geometry is this so let's go for wizard process same process like you need to create a process wizard you need to go for uh, number of cuts which is required and validate it let's go for corner parameters here I'm selecting a one cut which is a bisector so here we are going only the length so here I'm giving one mm of length or you can give for all three cuts or you can just go with a one roughing cut for the relief so I'm going for a 1 mm of length 
and selecting all and accept and calculate so now it has been uh, calculated so you can see here it has created a strike bisector line to create a process so you can see here the line is only for roughing skimming and skimming so let's see in uh, the simulation so just I am will be clicking and go, will go for a stock simulation This is a top view. Uh, sorry, I'll go for a, a cam and deactivate it. And let's go for a play button and click on play. So we can see here the first cut uh, it has taken a groove and uh, it has been completed all the roughing process. Next, we are moving for the skimming process. So you can see all the skimming process has been done so this is the third skimming process it has been completed so next uh, it is going for the second portion where we have a circular portion of a, a corner so all three cuts uh, it is taking it after this we have a V shape so you can see a V shape is taking place also and next is the chamfer we can see the stock in the corners as the chamfer and this is the bisector where we can find out uh, the corners has been bisected with the single line So next we will go for the post processor so now we will click on the go for NC and go for post processor and just select the XML CMT and generate the post so here it is the option we will accept it and here it comes the post so this is how the post looks like so this can be utilized in the machine so this has a command file and a ISO file so both so directly we can use in the machine thank you for watching subscribe to ch our channel for more videos and latest updates thank you